Shri Guru Bhyanamaha. I am Narani Anna and a classically trained Bharatanatyam dancer. I am a resident of Eden Prairie and the artistic director of Nritya Vidyalaya. Nritya Vidyalaya is an institute that trains aspiring dancers in the age-old dance form from India. I have had the privilege to get this training from Dr. Padma Sramanian, a world-renowned dancer. Bharatanatyam is a dance form that has elaborate hand gestures and complicated footwork. This art form consists of story two major concepts. One is the storytelling and the other is the rhythmic aspect. Usually the narratives or the storytelling is on um, Indian gods or also performed and adapted with Indian mythological stories. I would like to thank Peak People Fest of Eden Prairie for giving me this opportunity along with Keetana Srinivasan uh, to explore relevant social themes while keeping the traditional framework of Bharatanatyam for me and for Kirtana in music. She will be talking about the music exploration versus I'm going to be talking more about the dance. Me and Kirtana put together, we thought we would talk or bring about some social aspect in our presentation and what more than which was very close to me and I have not that I've personally been affected with, but I know a few who have been. Um, so we decided to do about domestic abuse. Um, this presentation is divided into four sections and explores a woman's journey from falling in love, becoming a mother, and who later is being abused in her own house. She also struggles and then finally she gets help in, from one of our social organizations and steps into the outer world hoping for hope. and I'm a student at University of Wisconsin-Madison which is just a five-hour drive from Eden Prairie so during the holidays or during the weekends I'm visiting my aunt Narayani so I think Eden Prairie is kind of my second home and I'm really excited to be collaborating with her on this People Fest 2020 project. I sing Carnatic music which is a South Indian classical form and it contains three main instruments so we've got the vocals, we've got the violin and we've got a percussion instrument called Mridangam. Carnatic music tends to depict religious stories, celebrates God, and expresses emotions. It generally consists of improvisations, rhythmic passages, and I'd say melodic phrases. I started learning Carnatic music when I was five years old, and it's the thing that I've been continuing to learn throughout my childhood and still am learning it. I think every artist starts a new project as a personal endeavor and the hope is that when we release it to public there's someone out there that resonates with our story or our message. Knowing firsthand how seasons and emotions are correlated, we try to bring the concept of the four seasons using the flower ways which you'll see to depict each season and the correlating emotion through the domestic abuse storyline. I start this piece singing a classical Carnatic piece. And I merged that into a jazz song and then into pop songs. The reason we did this is to show how universal the topic of domestic abuse is and to emphasize that art is a form of collaboration and it is universal. We hope that you enjoy and understand. Ah, 
ಶ್ರೀ ಅಮೃತ ವರ್ಷಿಣಿ ಹರದಿ ಪೂಜಿತೆ ಶಿವೆ ಭವಾನಿ ಆನಂದ ಅಮೃತ ಕಶಿಣಿ ಅಮೃತ ವರ್ಷಿಣಿ ಹರದಿ ಪೂಜಿತೆ ಶಿವೆ ಭವಾನಿ ಅಮೃತ ಶ್ರೀನಂದನಾದಿ ಸಂರಕ್ಷಿಣಿ ಶ್ರೀನಂದನಾದಿ ಸಂರಕ್ಷಿಣಿ ಶ್ರೀ ಗುರು ಗುಹ ಜನಾನಿ ಶ್ರೀಧ್ರೂಪಿಣಿ ಸಾನಂದ ಹೃದಯ ನಿಲಯ ಸದಯ ಸಾನಂದ ಹೃದಯ ನಿಲಯ ಸದಯ ಸತ್ಯ ಸೃಷ್ಟಿ ಹೇತವೆ ಸಂತತ ಚಿಂತೆಯ ಅಮೃತೇಶ್ವರಿ ಸಲೀಲ ವಾಷಯ 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 ಸ ಗ ಮ ಪನಿ ಸ ನಿ ಪ ಮ ಮ ಗ ಗ ಸ ನಿ ಪ ನಿ ನಿ ಸ ನಿ ಸ ಗ ಮ ಪ ಮ ಗ ಸ ಕ ಮ ಪ ಗ ಮ ಪ ನಿ ಪ ನಿ ಸ ಗ ಸ ನಿ ಪ ಮ ಮ ಗ ಸ ಸ ನಿ ಪ ಮ ಗ ಸ ಗ ಮ ಪ ನಿ ಸ ನಿ ಪ ಮ ಮ ಗ ಗ ಸ ನಿ ಪ ನಿ ನಿ ಸ ನಿ ಸ ಗ ಮ ಪ ಮ ಗ ಸ ಗ ಮ ಪ ಗ ಮ ಪ ನಿ ಪ ನಿ ಸ ಗ ಸ ನಿ ಪ ಮ ಮ ಗ ಸ ಸ ನಿ ಪ ಮ ಗ ಅಮೃತ ಕಶಿಣಿ ಅಮೃತ ವರ್ಷಿಣಿ
Ninja.